Introducing the challenger, the Demon! And his opponent, from parts unknown, weighing in at 285 pounds, the action champion, the A title coveted by legends and hungry young talent alike. Big title match here. In my opinion, this championship could main event any show, any place, any time. Bold declaration, Byron, but given the competitors vying for the title tonight, I'd be inclined to agree. And now in the most dangerous area inside the cell. Sequence of reversals there. Oh, ouch. Great job refocusing to reverse that. And some effective offense with that one. Landing the uppercut. from the Fiend is unmatched. And he sends him into the corner. Looks like he has something planned with his table, guys. I don't want to know. Through the table! He might never be the same after that trip through the table. Yeah, that looked particularly terrible. I don't see any way to come back from that. And Balor's attack gets cut off. Right the torso. The challenger not looking good right now. And this is where Hell in a Cell earns its name, people. The damage is just piling up as we head into deep waters. There's been a lot of career-defining and shortening moments inside Hell in a Cell. Corey, what do you think is the key to getting through a match like this unscathed? Cole, there is no getting through Hell in a Cell unscathed. Each and every competitor who's ever been inside the demonic structure has been fundamentally changed as a result. 
But the victors, at the very least, tend to know how to use the cell to their advantage as a weapon of destruction. I think that could play a big role in this one. Using the elbow as a weapon. Alex got him hooked. Up and back. 19. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Still in it with a quick kick out. It's unthinkable. Someone beating the one count at this point. And just raking at the eyes in desperation there. And responds with a counter of their own. Close line. What impact. This is nothing short of disturbing. Oh, so frightening. So bizarre. So eerie. What it could get worse to sister. And if you weren't frightened of the fiend before, he just gave you plenty of reason to be right there. I'm quivering. Placing them into the corner. Surprisingly quick kick out. I was not expecting that from him at this point. The challenger is in some big trouble. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. Incredible power slam. That's how you establish dominance. Nothing he can do. Oh, planted. Ooh, so. No, oh, he's shoving it down his throat. Not that it can't be. Will the rain continue? Headed to the top rope. Lost momentum here. Finn Balor's under the gun. Oh, with authority! Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Now, oh, his aggression, just pure brutality. Oh, easy. Smash. Anytime soon. And now's the time where Finn needs to keep the pedal to the metal, sustain his offense. Oh! He returns to the ring. Some intimidation tactics from the Fiend. Free their opponent's arm, has the arm trapped. Oh, stop right to the hand. Great display of strength with the suplex. The Fiend now with the clear upper hand. The Fiend has clearly frozen the opposition with fear.
provoking inverted suplex. There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, this is so bizarre and weird and freaky. And it follows it up with the sister of the nail. Cover. Two. Retains the title. Here is your winner. And still, action champion, the A successful title defense for him tonight. A pretty impressive defense. Challengers might think twice before coming at him now.